Hey, where are you from? Yo, yo. I'm from Flint, Michigan. Okay, so how's the water? I I'm gonna be real with you. They be lying and they poison it to kill everybody. Probably. Do you trust our government? No. All right, let me ask you a question on, on, a, on a serious note. Right. Do you consider a trans man to be a man? No. You no, don't. and neither do a trans woman. If you're a guy going to a girl, look at your feet, first of all. If you're a girl going to a guy, how's that period every month? Like, that's just never going to go away. Like, y'all can stay here and do this, that, and the third, and I'm going to be real with you. I feel like I'm like, I have nothing against gay people, but when you come out of character and do too much, chill. Like, these gay men be trying to fight females, trying to get uteruses and shit. Bro, us as females go through too much pain for y'all to sit here and try to have a baby. Like, fuck out of here. Let me do it. Let, let me cut your balls every month. How about that? Like, this shit, like, is bugging. And I fuck with the flag. It's Trump forever. Why do you support Donald Trump? Because he's real. Would you consider Donald Trump to be a real man? Yeah. What kind of uh, feedback do you get from your friends that you're a Trump supporter here in Savannah? It's 50-50. It's either a side eye, kind of like a oh, or it's a, they usually end up stopping the conversation. But you know what? Let's just not talk politics. Of them, strong supporters. So. And what would you say to Donald Trump if you could say one thing to him? I miss you. <laughs> I love it. I miss you so much. Yeah. yeah. Why do you support Donald I mean, Trump? I don't know how. Because he's the man for the job. Okay, well, That's right. Uh, he needs to, when his country needs to be run like a business, and he's the only one that can get us out of this mess. Now, do you think that we need to impeach Joe Biden? Well, she should have been in jail 100 years ago. Yeah, right? He should have never, well, he actually didn't win the race, but you know how it is. Awesome. So, you're yeah. on the side of truth. God bless you. Amen. Amen. Keep praying for him. That's right. Desperately trying. That's right. God's on his side. So, who are you guys voting for and why? Big T. Nice. Why you like him? Policies, the economy, everything I've seen, and I see that he really does care for everyone, not just one particular group. So, well said. Uh, and, and really, there's a whole list that I could name, but I won't. Because he loves this country. He's he did a fabulous job as president. He's a self-made billionaire. He's a successful businessman, and that's who we need running this country. Is someone who knows what's going on, what needs to be done, and how it needs to be done. He's a fantastic supporter of this country. We need to support him. What would you say to Joe Biden if you could talk to him right now? Well, I'd like to tell him to get out of the office, but then the option of who's coming in behind him is an even worse uh, situation. So um, they just need to pack up and go away. That's right. Yeah. Trump 2024? Absolutely. <laughs>
Yes, I do. Why? Because he's the man. He's a gift from God, one of them. God Almighty is the only one, but he is the man that's going to give back our country what we are missing right now. And we are not going to take no for an answer. Would you consider Donald Trump to be a real man? He is the man. That's right. <laughs> okay. My mother loves him too. You love him too? My mother's visiting from Boston. You raised her right. Yeah. God yeah. bless America and God bless Donald Trump. That's right. Well said. Thank you. Can you tell can you say a few words to Donald Trump? Can I? Please. Can I say a few words to Donald Trump? I would be more than happy to. Why do you stand with Donald Trump? Our quality of lives were so much better when he was president and I know this because my husband uh, is Italian. We came to America in 2014 from Italy. Awesome. And it is it was incredible watching an American live the American dream, not being in politics and now seeing someone be so resilient. Yeah. And I don't know many people that would be that able to withstand all the punches he's It's insane, right? You know, the amount of attacks he's had. Yes. Yeah. But it's inhumane, but all agree. He has made me proud to be American. That's right. Something I'm not currently at the moment, but hopefully in November that will change. Have you been to a Trump rally before? I've always wanted to. You need to go to one. He's going to have them soon in Florida. I we live in Naples. I hope. All right, he does. make sure you guys go to a Trump rally. All right. Amen. Are you out here today? Just to support our president. He's always been my president. This is the third time I'm voting for him. Man, you're a great voter. Yes. I'm jealous. I've only voted for him once. Wow. In 2020. Uh-huh. I'll be a two-time Trump voter. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> well, welcome to the Trump world. Where Thank you. We just want to bring our country back. I love patriotism. I just, I love my country. I'm for all good things, and I feel like our country's going down, so. Awesome. Thank you. What would you say to Donald Trump? He wins. You want him to win. What would you say to Donald Trump? Absolutely. Hero. Go. Hero. Go for it. And where are you guys from? Poland. 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 And New Jersey. Poland. Yeah. Very nice. Jersey City. Poland's based. God bless you, ladies. God bless you, ladies. We're doing a, a, a delivery, an airdrop. Oh, sweet. That's a uh, Trump 2024 flag <laughs> and a Trump 2024 hat. Brand new. Thank you very can you, much. Can you say God bless Trump? God bless Trump. There you go. If you could say one thing to Joe Biden tonight as we usher in the new year, what would you say to Joe Biden? Let's go, Brandon! Oh, that's my girl. Can you take my hat off and put it on your head real quick? Oh. Good, good balancing act. Hey, hey, put it that way. There we go. There we Let's go. go! So what made you buy that Trump shirt? Uh, because I hate liberals. <laughs> you hate the liberals? You want liberals to cry again? Yes, I do. And why you vote for Trump? One reason. One, because he loves America. It's good enough for me. So you're from New York and you're a Trump supporter? Yes, we are. Why? Oh, we love him. We love what he did. We love, we love all his policies. He he's was not great. A he was great, and he's not a politician. Yeah. And what's going on in New York right now? It's not. It's crazy world up in New York. I, I, used to to I used to love my state. Now, I think I'm, I'm, I'm getting out. Have you been to New York City anytime recently? We actually uh, we went, have we reluctantly. We don't time. go. We don't. We don't go down there anymore. It's, it's a mess. And did you see a noticeable difference in the homeless crisis? Yes. Yes. Yeah. It's, it's a shame. It was a beautiful city. What would you say to uh, Mayor Eric Adams if you could, if you could say, say anything to him? Go away. <laughs> That's it. Just Plain like, and simple. Don't, don't, don't be mad. Just go away. That's right. Yeah. It was great to meet you guys. You, you too. too. God bless Trump. Bye bye. Yeah. All right. So tell me, what makes you wear this shirt in public? What to made embarrass me, me? What made me re be a Republican? No, wear that shirt. shirt. Like, why do you wear why that shirt, you wear in public? shirt in public? Because I believe in the man. He is a good man, and he's a businessman, and he is going to take back the, the country. That's right. And what do you say to all the crazy leftists that say Trump is going to go to jail? I tell him to go fuck themselves. Me? That would be... <laughs> God bless you. That would be me, your God best friend. You. And God bless Trump. Well, thank you.